guys. So this is the last pre-recorded vlog that I have from before the ER visit and before I found out I have cancer. So, yep, another one hard to edit. Hey guys, so how are you? I do want to say that I did it. I finally did it. You guys know I'm scared of seeing a gyno. I talked about it in one of my last videos where it's just a fear that I have had. I get horrible anxiety around it. It makes me feel sick and nauseous and just like fear, like a lot of fear. And I've been having some lady issues for most of my life, but the last year it's been way worse. Um, something is clearly wrong. I have neglected my health for so long and now I'm just done neglecting it. So I made an appointment with a gyno. You guys, it took every ounce of me to do it, honestly. And the appointment's not for five weeks from now. That was the soonest they could do. Which A, that's scary, but B, I have to sit here and like, think about it every day knowing that it's gonna happen. I'd rather it have been sooner. And I also called and made an appointment to get my labs done because I am just like lethargic. I know my vitamin D is super low. My doctor doesn't want me to take over the counter vitamin D because it's just not enough. It's like this whole thing. And it has been storming every single day. So I haven't been able to get the sun. I've been pale, just not feeling the greatest. And I'm convinced it's my vitamin D because that's what my doctor said last time. And then I started taking vitamin D and I just feel so much better. So I'm getting my labs done in a few days. And I'm really excited for that because that definitely helps figure out a little bit of what's going on. Ugh, five weeks of just like, dread is going to be happening right now. So Becky and I are actually going to her sister's today because she needs help with getting ready. She's having a baby shower. And yes, it's a small gathering because things are opening up now and we're allowed to do things now. And I have a ton of baby shower gifts. I'm so excited. Um, it's actually Becky's nephew. His wife is pregnant and I'm so excited. They already have a cute baby boy and now they're gonna have a baby girl and I'm just like so pumped. I'm ready to spoil a little girl. I want a daughter so bad and it's just like, I know I'm never gonna get one. Um, I do have Twinkie and Rarity, which my heart, they're my heart. And obviously I have Wasabi. He's a boy though, so that's why I didn't mention him. Anyways, I notice every time I vlog lately, I'm just like so rambly, so I'm gonna... Hey guys, I need to sit outside, honestly. Um, oh! FedEx is here. Ah! FedEx is here. Bye. Cause I got a little something, something in the mail. Say hi. Hi. It's because I said hi. She thinks someone's here. Hello. She's so cute. Oh, FedEx. Oh my God, I'm scared. I get nervous. Hold on, I'm running away. <laughs> I don't want. Oh my God, Twinkie. Baby girl. She is a protector. She is my bodyguard. Hey, baby girl. Baby girl. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I love you. I love you. So we're actually about to do something. Baby. Twinkie. Hey, can you be a love bug? You're a love bug all the time. Okay. So we're actually about to give her a flea pill. Hi. Um, got it from the vet. I recommend go to the vet, 
get a flea pill for your dog. It works because it's that time of year. Dogs get fleas. Hey babe, do you wanna come outside with me and Twinkie? Not really. She said, not really. All right. The FedEx guy is not even here anymore, Twinkie. It's so funny, like when Twinkie sees a stranger, especially a male, she'll act like that. And then she gets to know them within whatever, three seconds. And then she falls in love and the person falls in love because everyone loves Twinkie. <gasps> Ew. Nope. Nope. There's chiggers everywhere. I don't know if it's like this for you guys where you live, but for some reason, insects are bad this year. There's chiggers, um, love bugs. We call them stink bugs, but I heard that they're also called love bugs. Wow. It's so bad. And then we found, um, I guess the love bugs had babies. You guys, it was disgust. There was so many. And I'm like, nope. <gasps> oh, disclaimer. Ew, oh my God. <sighs> if you don't like bugs, I have the goosebumps. Ew. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, if you guys don't like bugs, fast forward. Oh my God, like 30 seconds. This is what I'm talking about. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. And they're also crawling everywhere. See all those? Uh-uh, y'all. <laughs> I'm running for the hills. Um, our landlord got us some, like, bug spray that we're supposed to spray in the house. Ew, I'm itching. Ugh. Like, you guys are probably like, damn, that girl's extra. I am extra. I don't like stuff like that. But I want to be outside, you know? It was supposed to storm today. But it didn't. The FedEx guy is back. I don't think he's coming here, though. I've been ordering so much stuff, it's so bad. I just, sometimes I can't stop spending money and other times I'm like frugal. There's no in between with me, it's really weird. I'm sorry, I had to show you guys those bugs because I told you I wasn't joking. Was not joking, it's so bad. Are you a good girl, you wanna go in the backyard? Come on, come on, love. look at that love bug. We gotta give you flea medicine. And we also give the cats flea medicine. Um, theirs is a little different. You have to like put it on their skin. So that's okay. Sometimes they get a little confused and they're like, what are you doing? Okay, they don't literally say that. But. Do you guys ever make a wish? I'm gonna make a wish right now. Oh wait, I kinda like how this one looks. I hope that wasn't bad luck. I just let it go. I like this one better. Okay, so we're gonna make a wish together. You guys can make one too. Oh, there's a bug on it. Oh my, I can't with the creatures. I literally am about to go inside and never ever come back out. I'm still gonna do it though. Okay, so we're gonna have a moment of silence. Let's do our wish and then I'll blow it. Okay. I wanted to get every last bit off, but I feel like I'm super annoying right now. Twinkie, are you ready to get out of this infested insects? Come on, come on, come on baby girl. 
she's looking at me like um no because there's like some stairs over there and sometimes we'll walk up them but uh-uh not today sis <laughs> it's so gross out here what is going on i used to want to go camping but not no more oh nope nope you guys if you don't like bugs fast forward 15 seconds okay you guys more and they're trying to get in here what <laughs> come on Twinkie. you want a treat come on baby girl let's go inside get some foods get some treats get some flea pills let's get out of here uh, nope I'm gonna walk around the house, do a big full circle, and go back where I came from. <laughs> right? California? Where I came from? All right, you guys. I was just gonna sit out here, have a wonderful time. What are you sniffing, baby? But that did not turn out how I planned at all. And I'm sorry if you guys are like, gosh, she can't even breathe or hold, hold her phone up right. I'm fat. Life is what life is. I'm working on it. You good, babes? Come on. For a little walk. Yeah, our yard is huge. And the circumference of our house is huge. So, sometimes I'll just walk around it. More like waddle, am I right? Okay. And I also have to get that package. It's supposed to storm soon, or I would take her on the leash. <sighs> Anyways, you guys, <laughs> it's been fun, it's been real. I love when people stare. They're probably like, damn, that girl's fat. Yes. Yes, I am. All right. Whoa. You ready, Twink? Look at this. Hi, kitty. Hi, pretty gray. Someone asked why I don't let my cats outside. Because they're indoor cats. People would steal them, let's be real, because they are perfect. People just really like their breed, especially wasabi. Perfect little kitties. I don't trust it. Plus, I don't want them to run away. Get back, baby. And not only that, fleas and dirt and just gross stuff. Everyone would want this baby. Yeah. Golly. Okay. I have some things I have to do. Bye. Okay, so Twinkie and I, she's down there in the floorboard. Okay, first of all, we were stuck in standstill traffic for over an hour in a storm. And it was the longest line of cars I have ever seen in my life. It was so far down that I, like the cars looked this tiny and then I couldn't even see cars anymore because my eyes don't work that way. But it was crazy. I'm thinking there was a wreck or a crash or something and then it started storming really bad. It was a mess. But right now, Twinkie and I are in the car. Becky is actually in Hobby Lobby because she has to pick up something for her sister for the baby shower. I think like it's some like glue or something. And I was just sitting here. There are so many people going in there and no one is wearing a mask. Becky is. She's actually walking out right now. That was perfect timing. Um, and I'm just over here like, I find that to be so strange because masks really help because if you have the virus and you don't know, it can really help with like not spreading it. Were you able to find it, babe? Yeah. Twinkies at the floorboards, so be careful. Little girl. I'm sure she'll be okay. Oh, he's such a cutie, babe. See, this is what Becky looks like in her mask glory. Come here. <laughs> she had to pick up Mod Podge. Oh, this is gloss. So this is not a glue. Oh wait, it is. It's a water-based sealer glue and finish. So. Hey, twink, twink. 
Oh, I guess she wants to go down there. I don't know if she's gonna like that very much. We still have a pretty long way to go. I'd say about 35 minutes. Yeah, I don't have to stop me gas too. Okay. Well, yeah. I don't know. I just find it weird that like no one's wearing masks right now. I just, it's kind of skeevy, but you know, it's whatever. So we got back a couple hours ago from Becky's sister's house. They actually, um, okay. So Becky's sister's husband built tables. He built three tables and Becky's sister and Becky stained them. Now Becky has, what, what is this stuff called? It is wood stain. Wood stain all over her. She has it all over her arms, her legs. It's completely dry though. Mm, I don't shave, I don't care. Shave? Oh, I mean you, you do, but you haven't recently. No. So she's about to go shower. I just had to show you that. Got super messy. It got on her hat, like on the bill of it. But oh my God, they did so good. I didn't help at all because they didn't need my help. But yeah, it's fun going over there. Um, I've just needed some normalcy in my life. I can tell you that much. But anyways, I think I'm gonna end this vlog and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Goodbye. Thank you.